Shizandra berry is a very special tonic herb. It belongs to an elite class of tonic herbs known as the three treasure tonic herb. So it belongs to the same class as reishi, ginseng, and goji berry, which are all very unique and very potent tonic herbs that work on a holistic level to heal the body as a whole. Now all these herbs, they have some things in common. They're immunomodulators and they're powerful adaptogens and antioxidants. However, some of the differences in these herbs I want to get into. So looking at Shizandra as a tonic herb or three treasure herb, as I said, it promotes and supplements all three treasures, Jing, Qi, and Shen. So essentially what this means is that Shizandra promotes our physical well-being, it promotes our mental emotional well-being, and it also supports our spiritual well-being. Now let's talk about a few of the benefits of Shizandra specifically. So first, as I mentioned, as a three treasure herb, Shizandra is an adaptogen, which means it's a bi-directional herb that either gives us energy without stimulating, so it energizes us when we need energy to either get through work or to just get through our day or even overcome infection, disease, or stress. However, on the other hand, if our bodies need to de-stress, relax, and sort of become uh, more calm in situations, it'll actually help our body uh, alter to that so it's sort of a uh, hormone immune balancing herb in this way which makes it wonderful of course for not just our physical well-being but our mental and emotional well-being because it helps us adapt to stress or become more resilient in the face of stress now Shizandra actually translates to the five flavor berry and that's because it contains all unique tastes sweet salty pungent bitter and astringent now why this is important is because in traditional Chinese medicine, the goal is to really achieve balance. And Chinese medicine knows that our body is just a microcosm of planet Earth. And these five flavors are microcosms really of the five different elements found in Earth, which is wind, water, air, earth, and fire. So we see that these elements are contained within this berry and also these elements are contained within our body and we can use food and herbalism to sort of balance out any of these sort of uh, elements going on in our physical body. And we can look at this example, um, wind being a metaphor for the lungs, um, water being a metaphor for our fluids, our sex fluids, the water in our body, the blood, and so on and so forth. So traditional Chinese medicine is really looking at the body as a um, sort of microcosm or just a piece of the whole that is planet Earth. And by looking at it from this way, the more we tune our bodies into nature and how it functions, the healthier we become. In other words, poetically, we can only be as healthy as planet Earth is. And if we, the more we resist nature, the, usually the more disconnected and ill we become. So Shizandra is a very special berry in this way because it actually nurtures all five of those elements and all five of those tastes. Um, Shizandra berry also is one of the only herbs that promotes the free flow of all 12 meridians in the body, which are sort of our energetic channels that we want to be free so that way there's no stagnation in a certain organ or a certain system. However, specifically looking at these tastes and the profiles of what they do in our body, when we look at an astringent quality, we see how Shizandra berry has gotten its uh, reputation as a very potent skin tonic. Now, Shizandra, how it promotes the well-being of the skin is in two ways. First, it promotes Wei Qi, which is basically um, the traditional way of understanding our lymphatic system and our how the our chi or blood is uh, promoted in our lungs and how that affects our skin which is like the lungs also a barrier system and detoxification system so in layman's terms um, this astringent quality helps moisten the external layer of our skin so that way we are protected internally from external pathogens so any sort of uh, imbalances from or pathogens from the external world become uh, less harmful to our internal body when our wee chi is strong and shizandra berry does this with this astringent quality. However, as I mentioned, Shizandra also has a bitter quality which helps promote the health and appearance of our skin by basically cleansing our liver. So it's been said that within a hundred days of continual use of Shizandra, we're going to have a more apparent, beautiful, glowing skin. And in fact, it has been said that it is the traditional oriental women of more noble or elite classes use this three treasure herb to promote beauty and glowing skin into their later years in life. So now the way that the bitter quality actually helps promote our skin health from the inside out is like I said by promoting the health of our liver. So in Chinese medicine the skin is just referred to as the outer liver. So in other words our skin is only as healthy as our liver is. If you want healthy glowing skin, clean your liver. 
And the bitter quality in Shazandra does this very well. In scientific studies, Shazandra has been shown in over 500 case studies to help eradicate hepatitis, prevent um, degeneration of the liver, fatty liver disease, and many other imbalances of the liver that we see in modern medicine or the modern world. However, more traditionally speaking, this bitter taste that Shazandra provides actually stimulates our vagus nerve, which is the nerve that's connected from at the back of our tongue to our liver to secrete bile and send a signal to our liver to cleanse and detoxify. So in this way, we find that Shazandra actually helps aid the detoxification of any sort of pollutants, toxins, and even radiation from the liver and make sure that it's escorted through the bloodstream, either out through one of our detoxification organs, through the skin, the lungs, etc. So moving on, we find that Shazandra, aside from being a you know, tonic to the liver and to the skin, being an adaptogen, we find that actually also promotes our sexual function and our hormonal balance. And it does this in two ways. In the traditional Chinese medicine sense, it promotes the health of our water qi, which is basically the fluid stored in our kidneys. And that's where a lot of our sexual fluids are created, and that's where our semen's created, that's where female excretions are created, and, and any sort of other sex fluid going on. By promoting this water qi, or the fluid in the sex fluid in our uh, sex glands, our kidneys, we're actually gonna be able to experience greater levels of fertility, sexual reproductive health, and then even higher quality of sperm and female secretion. Shizandra taking over a continual basis can help women experience um, greater uh, blood flow to their reproductive organs and for men it can even improve sexual function um, and on the performance end and on the biological end. So lastly we find that Shizandra as an adaptogen can help with all sorts of different um, endurance sort of activities. It's really great for uh, mental focus, cognition, and even improving our endurance in athletics, sports, or just any sort of physical physical activity and it's going to do this of course by basically supporting our endocrine system it's going to provide nourishment to the adrenals which is going to help improve our concentration focus our motivation and then like I said of course provide energy for any sort of endurance activity and these are just a few of the many benefits of Shizandra like I said as a three treasure herb it's really going to help heal and balance the body as a whole however these are some of the most important functions that Shizandra has um, of course as a super food berry. It is very high in antioxidant qualities, which makes it a great anti-aging herb in that way. And of course, many of the other benefits that we find are just really stemming to supporting the functioning of these vital organs or vital systems in the body, which in Chinese medicine are all interconnected. So if we support the well-being of our immune system, of our nervous system, adrenals, our liver, which is a main endocrine organ, then we're going to find that overall our body is going to function better as a whole. So if you're interested in learning more about Shizandra, or if you want to try some out for yourself, then just head to the bottom of this video and click the link below.